Good morning and welcome to News and Coffee Time brought to you by Interieste.com. We'll be reading the headlines with Pico in English Daily, so grab yourself a cup of coffee and follow us along. We're skipping over the national news and only concentrating on the local Trieste's headlines. We're bringing the local news one day at a time. The front page of Piccolo this Thursday, July 21st reads, the fight against the fire is on the first page of today's El Piccolo. Carso is on fire, and this is officially the third day. It has been so. The hell in Carso fight, fighting nonstop, many places up in Carso between Monfagol and Gorice and Trieste have been evacuated as the Flames came a little too close to those houses. Uh, critical situations in Jamiano and Doberdo. And then uh, here in Mont Falcone, uh, there's, uh, it's mandatory to use FFP2 masks outside yes, and stay at home and close windows as it is impossible. It is getting harder to breathe outside. Delfino Verde volunteered to take people via um, by boat from Trieste to Monfalcone since thousands were stranded in a Trieste uh, train station. As you know, the trains to uh, Monfalcone have been cancelled due to the ongoing fire and you can reach it by Delfino Verde every 15 minutes today as well. And the highway, the many uh, cars and trucks waiting uh, for the highway A4 to reopen, as you know, uh, exit in Sistiana and Trieste have been closed due to, do to ongoing fire, of course, resulting in hours and kilometers of wait. An interesting article called This is what happens when you humiliate Carso. Uh, probably referring to the ongoing battle with a cable car that is supposed to be built there too among other things uh the horror of blackout is you know two days ago there was a big blackout in Trieste, and yesterday the mayor of Trieste uh urged everyone not to use the elevators as you can get stuck there there's a possibility of another black blackout today thursday again Uh, tonight in Piazza, uh, uh, supporting all the workers of Warzala that is about to close down, 4 p.m. Piazza Unita, uh, everyone, the mayor urges everyone to come down to Piazza. Uh, there might be... Aqua Marina is to be rebuilt, uh, another swimming pool with the goal of uniting the older generation. University uh, Alina graduates uh, in law. Uh, while having two little kids, yeah. Pic Piccolo rightfully dedicates a whole page to her. Culture section of today's Il Piccolo, Ariella Reggio and the premier of story in Middlefest. She is the Signora of Theatre. Alexander Lokic. Project Beethoven in Tomorrow Castello di San Giusto. 
Weather forecast is going to be hot again today with highs of 35 degrees Celsius. Stay cool out there. This was News and Coffee Time brought to you by Intrieste.com. Thank you for listening.